again to the 400-ish range and just to restate something that I've already said uh, there's more mass and material here so I'm going to do uh, a lot more concentrating underneath and in this area to get it up to 400 plus where this side is pretty thin there isn't a whole lot of material there so it doesn't take long to do that side so I'm going to spend a lot more time on this side, getting it prepared, getting it uh, up to temperature. Give a dross or get give a sprue cleared out and we'll let that cool down to where we can take it apart and uh, see if we got a nice bearing made there also. Again that front one, you know, this area here you gotta concentrate on getting a little extra heat in it. Well, we have it out of both vents right there and I've got have it out of both vents right here so I think we've got that one full boy we don't look at that long <laughs> any odds So I'm, I'm just going to check what I'm looking for is to make sure that I've got that bearing all 
fit it into the saddle and I'll do that on both sides and the peening process uh, just gets that to shape in there just real nice so quite happy we got the third bearing to pour we're moving on